Well, first of all, the opportunity to go to UCLA was a dream come true for me. Uh, my father grew up a Jackie Robinson fan, and it was something that was important to me, knowing that Jackie Robinson had his start uh, at UCLA. I think what I liked most about being a student and athlete was that I was challenged to be great in both facets. Uh, UCLA is a very challenging university academically. It forced me to reach uh, beyond my grasp in many ways academically. From a baseball standpoint, we believe that we played the very best collegiate baseball in the country at that time. And so to have the opportunity to be inspired and to be challenged in both of those areas was very, very important for me, for my family, and certainly allowed me to be a better person and some, uh, someone who has benefited from that experience and utilize those experiences later in life. One of the first lessons that I learned from my coaches at UCLA as a middle infielder in the sport of baseball, when you turn a double play, you always need to expect the bad throw. Those that can make the, the, the double play when the throw is not good are the ones that are able to deal with adversity uh, in ways that uh, others can't. It's an important lesson to learn as an administrator of a program. Basically means that you need to be balanced, you need to be prepared, and you, an you need to anticipate that things may not always go your way. Entering into the profession of college athletics was a blessing for me. Um, it uh, really was the opportunity to pursue a passion. Uh, I always love sports. I always love being on a college campus, and I thrive on being around young men and women who have great aspirations, uh, that have great goals. The advice that I give to young people is that they have to pursue their passions, and they have to love what they do. No matter what area they get into, they have to really believe that it's the most important thing for them. And I always tell them that the big time is where they are. In other words, the only place that they can influence is the place that they're presently working at now. And if they do a great job there, then the Red Sea could open and they could walk through it to get to the next place. Hi, I'm Dan Guerrero. I'm a former NCAA student athlete from UCLA.